So guys, welcome to Wroclaw. Welcome to Wroclaw. Right now. Yeah. I want the picture with you. I want it. And their name is Dick Dick. I'm taking the video. Sit. <laughs> So guys, welcome to Wroclaw. Welcome to Wroclaw. Right now, yeah. we are at the first place where we wanted to go. It's an activity, not something with like traveling, but it's an activity. This place is called War Zone, and we are here to do shooting. Exactly. We are gonna shoot. I believe with I want to guns. be honest. That's Very excited. Exactly. So let's go in. Let's go in and see. Perfect. War zone is a shooting place located just outside the center of the city, about 20 minutes from the center. Once you enter and select your package, since uh, we were beginners, we went ahead with a beginners package. Uh, the instructor will give you some safety training, some safety uh, instructions before you start. Then you enter the shooting range and there are guns and instructor will explain you and will train you right from loading your gun to adjusting your gun, your gun shooting positions and everything will be taken care of and then he, you are uh, allowed to shoot and you are trained to shoot and it's a fun activity and it was really great for us to, experience, to have such an experience. Right, finger go as high as you can. Yeah, now grab the magazine, grab the mag, put it inside. Okay, grab it, pull it, and ready. Okay, just one. So left hand here, put both elbows on the desk. Do not tense your muscles. No, just relax and look with your right eye inside the scope. Do you see two circles? Put small circle on the black field. Are you ready? Okay, pull once. It's okay. To continue. Once you are done with shooting, you can go and check your target, how many shots you had on your target, how many shots you missed, you get the whole tally and it's a fun activity and it's really great to know how you are doing. Since it was our first mm -hmm. time, we were not that great but overall it was a fun thing to do. So, hello, hello guys. <laughs> Hi. Welcome to Wroclaw. <laughs> so first of all, introduction, we have here with us. Anya, my roommate, my friend, uh, my best friend who is from <laughs> Ukraine as well, and nice she decided to, to join us and because she wanted some practice. Yeah. <laughs> exactly. So, yeah. war zone. How do you feel? Amazing. Cool. Amazing. Uh, we. I'm telling you, she's a natural. Natural. <laughs> Natural sniper. I'm I had a hidden like... talent. I didn't know about that. Exactly. The so good the aim. Best. Exactly. The be best aimer am amongst us. Me being from India, the worst. <laughs> <laughs> no, really. The only one person who was shaking, having the third gun, was me. <laughs> she was scared to shoot. So responsible. I was scared to shoot the first time, first and second. Okay, but third one, something happened. And uh, <laughs> but it was cool. I liked it. Of course. I liked it, and I, I think, think we all did. I think it's like it's like an addiction right now. Like you <laughs> you know that there there is Af something that you can yes. do good. After third gun, I went for fourth. <laughs> <laughs> Much powerful. I was a shotgun now. Let's go. No, I mean it's amazing. Yeah. Must try. Everybody should. <laughs> Try to, to shoot. I'm telling you, 
Life will be good. Yes. Life could be a dream <laughs> if you can choose. <laughs> You will feel relieved. Exactly. Yeah, exactly. But to be honest, it feels really good. It feels like, good. You want to do more. Yes. It's like it's not enough. Yeah. That's what she said. <laughs> Take care of your safety. <laughs> Don't Here feel... somewhere out there. Take care yes. of your safety. Of yes. Course. First if, of all, if you shoot in the goal, not in the human being, yeah, then it's not enough. <laughs> so guys, right now, after this fun activity, we decided are... to go to the zoo. And. Let's go. This is go. this is an African zoo. No, like it calls it was call, it calls Africarium. Africarium. So the weather is good so perfect, we'll see animals. Exactly. Yeah. Let's go. Let's go. Let's see fishes, animals. Oh, and we have a map. Perfect. At first you need to go and buy yeah, we have lots of animals. We can see every oh. animal. Wow. Well, that's the main attraction for me. Okay. <laughs> Let's go. <gasps> Small ones. No, zebras. 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 I have zebras. And yeah. Oh. I want a picture of you. I want a picture of you. That's so nice. Oh my god. Dangerous but beautiful. Okay, let me play. So we are now in the Africarium in Rotslo. <laughs> Look at this two happy women to see animals. Oh no! <laughs> Amazing. So, are you ready to see yes, some we fish? Yeah, ready to see whales. Whales. whales? They don't whales. have whales they here. They don't have whales. Whales, whales, and whales. Whales. They don't whales have whales here. Too big. Bob. You're not going to put it in the vlog because if you put it in the vlog, I'll kill you. No, I'm going to put it in the No, vlog. no, please. Okay. No. <laughs> oh. 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 He's shit. eating. Okay. Oh, okay. <laughs> Come out. Hi, if buddy. You're there. Come out if you're there. What's your name? I will. I will call you Tom. They're so. <laughs> 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 in sweaters, in a tropical jungle. In a, exactly. Uh, we are searching, but it's okay because it's first to see a lot of trees. Kid. Uh, <laughs> now, how do you feel? Uh, this is how India feels like this one. Oh my god. It's like don't cry. You can do support, support. They both console each other. Yeah, Only they are kissing. Yeah, look forward.
So hello guys. Hello guys. Hello. Right now, it's not night. It's still evening. It's five. Yes. It's only five p.m. Yes, but since winter is coming, it's already dark, and we are just outside the zoo. Yeah, we just came out. <laughs> yeah. What? How was the zoo? Uh, it was. Good. It was. Yeah. It was. Giraffes are the best. <laughs> Giraffes are very beautiful and. Uh, there are a lot of fishes, variety of animals, variety of uh, plants, variety of fishes, variety of everything. Seabird. Yeah. That seabird. But we haven't seen lions and elephants. Yeah, yeah I mean it was good. It was yeah. good. There also have, uh, they also have another part of zoo which calls um, Garden of Lights. Garden but of it's lights. for limited time. It's not yes. gonna be always there. It, it is in March. Yeah. March 2024. During the winter season. Yeah, season. so you can also visit that place along with zoo. Yeah. So that was all about zoo. Now we'll go to a restaurant called Conspira, which is related to history. About yeah. which Hisina will talk. Yes. Later. <laughs> Later. <laughs> bye bye. Bye. <gasps> oh, this so, is connected with history. Oh, so this door, another fifth one. This one is connected with history. Yes, because uh, why doors here? Because the party Solidarność. Yeah. This one, uh, it's a po it's a political party, uh, which actually was the opposition party during Soviet times. And uh, as the protest, one of protests of this party, uh, they decided to put like those things oh. and be indoors because they couldn't, uh, they weren't allowed to gather outside because of the political system which existed those days. So. Uh, they had to, uh, they had to put something, and then they realized that oh, okay, we are uh, members of this party, and then they had protests, and people were just going and such things because it was, open. and then they actually um, played a big role in Poland getting away from Soviet Union and communism. So amazing. Uh, right now it's really the cure. So that much is fine. Perfect. So guys, right now. We are inside the Conspira restaurant and this restaurant doesn't look like a restaurant. I feel like I am in some room with lots of history. It looks like a museum. There is lots of old stuff here and I don't know why it's so much but I have a friend here who knows everything about it yeah. no, and she is she has some knowledge about it. Yeah, and so, so she will tell you the history behind this place. Exactly. So, so we are uh, here inside this restaurant and uh, this restaurant is uh, connected with more history because during uh, World War II and after uh, Polish people were coming here gathering and discussing some stuff here and as you can see this doesn't look like a restaurant it looks more like a room or I don't know a place where you gather with your friends and just talk about something guys this is the menu and this is what we have ordered you will see this in some time it has all different kinds of traditional polish food along with that we have ordered this drink polish drink which calls mute, mm -hmm. yeah, mute. it's very very no it's in the end yeah what how is this pronounced uh, mute 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 Honey, which you can drink, but it's not honey. I think it's like mix of something. Okay. Have you all tried it? Right Perfect. Now? Because I have never tried it. As well. And it's so warm. It yes. can you can get it at room temperature or warm, and we have ordered it warm. With cinnamon. With cinnamon. Cinnamon. Perfect. Yeah. And along with that, we have also ordered pork knuckle, which is also a traditional food from Bavaria, but it's also a traditional food for Polish people. Exactly. So this is the next thing which we have ordered. So we are excited to try. Oh, and here's our wine. Cinque, cinque means thank you, guys. Yes, and nazdrowie means cheers. Cheers. As you already said, so, I think. Let's. It smells good. So one, two, three. How to cheers? Nazdrowie. 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 Okay, so all these things, traditional Polish food. What is this thing? Which one? This thing. I don't know. Open that. 
know it's Bigos, yes. It's Bigos. Oh, but I don't know oh, it's wow. Sarah Crowley and Miss Stew. Sarah Crowley and Miss Stew. Okay. And then bread. <laughs> so this is uh, meat and um, and other vegetables are mm -hmm. frozen. Basically, in sister's fave. Uh, yeah, this like you might have heard. This is pierogi. Pierogi. This is pierogi. This is uh, sausages. sausages. Typical. This is uh, cabbage, which is with meat and rice inside. Wow. And this cucumber. Is cucumber, because it's typical than vodka. <laughs> really, I mean. And also some sauces. Some sauces. And potato. I think and it's, it's mustard meat, perhaps. It's? It's mustard. Mustard. <laughs> yeah. Okay. I think so. Wait. Interesting. I mean, like sauces are. Yeah. Sauces, typical sauces. Like, I don't know. Sauces are not so long, but this could be. Yeah. yeah. All, all of the stuff there. So. I'm going to try everything. Everything. We are going to try everything. And we'll tell you how it is. I know how it is, but I'm able to do this. <laughs> yeah. yeah. I love bigos. Bigos are great. Bigos. Is the best thing ever. Best thing ever. I've actually forgot people, about that. Like, some people don't, don't like it, but I adore it. I also tried it in Krakow. Amazing. Very good. So let's try it. Let's go. Let's go.